So, how I grew my hair out? You wanna know how I grew my hair out? Well, keep watching. Whoa, whoa. What's the deal, Champ Tribe? It's your boy, it's Amazing. I'm back with another video for y'all today. I get so many uh, questions in the comments about how I grew my hair to be this long. I get a lot of questions about the products I use. Uh, I had waves. I had waves all my life. I didn't know I can grow my hair long at all until I started to grow my hair. So it's gonna be a lot you're gonna have to do, you're gonna have to deal with with your hair, but it's all a journey for you to, to learn yourself and love yourself. The main thing I would say when it comes to growing your hair is just grow it. Just start growing it. It's plain and simple. Don't get too many haircuts. Just, and just let your hair grow. Just thug it out, let it grow. Cause you don't know how long your hair can get until you just let it grow with these remaining steps that I'm telling y'all. Second thing for me is protective styling. I love when my hair is in a protective style, such as twists or braids, because I can manage my hair a little bit easier. Just keeping my hair left alone for some time, it really does, it really does help in growing your hair. Hairstyles like twists and braids, all that is protective styling, and it's gonna protect your hair when you have those lazy moments when you might not wanna do your hair, or you know, you just, just get lazy with your hair. So twists, braids, hairstyles like that is gonna be vital to you growing your hair long and healthy. I haven't did a wash and go in so long since I got my hair cut, bruh. I haven't did a wash and go in a while. So I'm gonna try to do a video on that real soon. Along my journey, I kept my hair in twists. And then when I was finally able to get braids, I switched to braids. And the best decision I made in my life going that route because you know, leaving your hair out like this. I'm gonna go to sleep on this, matter of fact. I'm gonna sleep on this hair. And you know, I don't really wanna be doing that because my ends can potentially break off or anything like that. But the products I use, I don't have any product recommendations as of right now, but I was using whatever I can get my hands on, the cheapest product to probably the most expensive product. I was just, you know, just trying to get my feet wet, dipping and dabbing in all type of products to see how my hair would like it. So with products, I can't really give you no recommendation off the back of my head. But when I first started, I was using Cantu and Shea Moisture products for the longest. I don't use those products as of right now. So that's the thing with your natural hair journey. You gotta find products that's gonna work for your hair because your product you might see somebody else using might not work for you. If you find a product that you know you like, you see your hair benefiting from the product, stick with that product and keep your hair moisturized. Let me walking out, let me walking around here with dry hair and brittle hair. Keep your hair moisturized because that our hairs love moisture. Our hair loves moisture and Without moisture, your hair is not gonna grow. It's not gonna grow without moisture. I use creams, I use oils, I use shea butter here and there. I use a lot of moisturizing products and so far it's been working for my hair because it was so much longer than this. I mean, it's still it's still there, but it, it would have been way longer than this. It would have been way longer. Way longer. I'm a product junkie, so I would you know, go out and buy a bunch of different products. And probably only like two. For haircuts, when I first started, I wasn't really getting haircuts like that, but I was getting edge up and lined up like every two or three weeks. So that's the thing you do want to do and as your hair gets longer and it progress you might have to do you know trims here and there when i first started i don't really know better i didn't know nothing about growing hair i didn't know nothing about how long my hair can get i didn't know my hair type my hair texture none of that a lot of y'all ask what kind of haircut i have now i just have a little taper take my beard take the size of my head I don't go too well with my taper. 
my barber know knows exactly what I want. So yeah, he just cut me as such. Occasionally I do cut my own hair, edge up and whatnot, but my clippers, man, they sometimes be cut my face. I don't know if y'all can see, I got like a little scar right here. Right here, haven't went away, man, because my clippers been cutting me. I don't know what that's about. So I try to go to the barber shop <laughs> a little bit more than usual. I'm gonna try to get probably shoulder length hair while shrunken. Because my, my hair, even though it's long, it's to my shoulder already, the shrinkage is real. I wanna get my hair at least to right here. I just really wanna see how long I can get my hair. That's it. Something that really, really, really helped me along my journey and to keep my hair, you know, from breakage and being dry and brittle was protecting it at night. As long as you protect your hair at night, you good. Either with a bonnet or a satin pillowcase. I have a picture of someone right here with a satin pillowcase. Either a satin pillowcase or a bonnet. It's gonna be your best friend while you grow your hair. A lot of y'all like wave caps, but wave caps is not gonna work for something like this. If I try to put a wave cap on with this, my hair is gonna be up. My hair's gonna be, bruh, my hair will be all tangled and twisted. With this, man, just pop this bad boy on and go to sleep. That's why some of y'all might have breakage or damaged hair. Because you're not sleeping in one of these or a satin pillowcase. So if you if you're not feeling this, at least get you a satin pillowcase, man. Cause it's gonna for sure take your hair to to a new level. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me, bro. And I'm still growing my hair. It's a process. It's not easy, but it's so worth it because you would be the one that said, oh, I grew my hair. I do have like the oil I use now. It's an oil. It's an oil product that I made myself. And I'm gonna tell y'all the ingredients because ingredients is, you know, something personal. But I've been using that on my scalp and my hair. And also, make sure you drink some water. Make sure you drink your water. That's number one. That's number one. Lovely. So yeah. Champ Tribe, you know the deal. Thank you for watching. Continue to be you. Continue to be amazing. And don't let nobody stop you. It's your boy, Be Amazing. And I'm sorry.